game time for the untouchable true school sports. Let's go, baby. Bow. Be careful what you wish for because because it can become a reality. Yeah. All right, Ben and Taylor here, True School Sports. I'm with the fighting fighter Las Vegas, Andres Cortez. Uh, first of all, nice to meet you, Andres. Nice to meet you too, bro. Yeah, it's a really interesting fight you got with, with Abraham Nova. Seems to be a little bit of tension there. Um, how, how do you feel about the fight? Um, you know, I, I definitely, uh, I see uh, he's a little nervous, you know. He yeah? Definitely don't got the same energy that he did online. So uh, I'm excited to uh, really, um, you know, show him that, you know, I'm all in and this is what I do and I, and I keep I keep the same energy throughout the whole week. He's he going to find out. Okay. For, for those that don't know what type of energy he was bringing, what, what, what type of energy was he giving you on social media? Uh, he was talking a lot of mess and like, he knocked me out all blah, blah, And, you know, I expected him to tell me that. And when we got face to face, he didn't say nothing. So. Okay. He didn't keep that same energy. Nah, he was talking about God bless. <laughs> Ben and Taylor here, True School Sports. I'm with one of the most dynamic fighters at 130, Abraham Spinova. Abraham, uh, nice to see you. Same here, nice to see you. Absolutely. Uh, you got a really interesting fight. Quite possibly the most interesting fight on the card against you know, Andres Cortez. I know you guys had some back and forth. Where does all this back and forth stem from? You know, they stem from our last press conference. The last time I fought here in Vegas of last year, you know, he, he said something in the press conference where he's going to beat me and his opponent at the same night, something like that. And I said, hey, be careful what you wish for. I asked for this fight this year. They gave me the fight. So now we're going we, we to get it on Friday Friday night, June 21st here on ESPN+. Plus. Okay. Well, what, what do you make of him uh, 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 as a fighter, like stylistically? Like, what, like um, he's a good fighter, you know, he, he, he must have been doing something right to get to this level, to get to this position. So he's a good fighter. Um, I, I, looking at it, you know, from, from, you know, from a TV stand, he doesn't look that crafty or whatnot. But, I mean, he doesn't look that skillful or whatnot, but he's doing something right. He puts pressure, he throws punches and combinations, you know, um, he's doing something right. So I have a lot of respect you know, towards him because I know he has something. I don't know what it is. I got to find out fr <laughs> um, Friday night, but I know he has something. But um, yeah, he's a good fighter, and um, I'm excited to you know um, uh, fight him on Friday night, and uh, and definitely get a victory. Thank over. you for watching another video on the Untouchable True School Sports Empire. I'm at the Box Hall of Fame out here in Canfield, in New York. And for more great boxing content just like this video, make sure you click and subscribe right over here.